Hello and welcome. I'm going to show you how to use XFX Grid Slideshow, a modular set of plugins that build great slideshows within Final Cut Pro 10. Before we look at the timeline, let's have a look at the title browser and run through the effects quickly. Under Twos, you'll find all the grids. These go on top of the pictures. And as you can see, they're all labeled 221, 222, etc. Those match the rest of the layers. Offsets are under three. Now you may ask, what are offsets? The simplest way to show you is to play the timeline. You can see the girl in this hat here has got um, the picture split up into ninths. But in the ninths, the picture's actually offset. It would be a bit dull just to have a straight image behind the grid. So by using the offsets, you can offset each tile to make it look a bit more interesting. Then in four, we have masks. And you might say, what are masks for? Because this is a slideshow. Well, if we look at something complicated like this, you can see the masks have been used to use the top three images in this 16th composition. And then the bottom one with the VW is the opposite. The transition overlays go on top and there's different ones for coming in and out of the transition. Easiest thing is if I show you, and here we have eighths being built up to a solid white and then comes back out with a quad. And lastly, we just have the two texts from the actual demo. If we go over to the effects browser, we can see we've got a range of effects that do the moves. So the pictures will actually move behind the grid with the offsets included, and that's what makes it look interesting. There are two sets, one for 1080 and one for 4K. That's a quick run through of the effects. In the next tutorial, we're gonna build a slideshow from scratch.